What up guys, Tom Ludemoser here with Seriously Fast Media. Today we got a pretty short video for you. We got a little bit of news. Some of the big news was that you were going to get Harrison Burton as well as Jennifer Jo Cobb. They were slated to run their first ever NASCAR Cup Series races at Talladega this upcoming weekend. Well, NASCAR put a big pause to that. NASCAR is saying no, time out, to Jennifer Jo Cobb. Uh, she, when you try and run NASCAR races, you have to basically fill out a racer resume, submit it to NASCAR. Um, I don't know all the superb details on how to do that, but uh, apparently she did not. And when you actually look back at her resume anyway, there's not a lot that she has to offer. She hasn't run a, a ton of Xfinity Series races, and she hasn't won any Xfinity Series races. Harrison Burton, on the other hand, two seasons running in the Xfinity Series. Uh, this is his second full-time season. He's got a handful of wins. He's run at restrictor plate tracks. He knows what he's doing. He knows how to race. He's been fairly decent at some of these restrictor plate races. So they're allowing him to run. Jennifer Jo Cobb is not. So that 15 car for Rick Ware Racing is not going to be run by Jennifer Jo Cobb. She was supposed to be the first female driver to run a Cup Series race since the retirement of Danica Patrick at the Daytona 500 a couple years ago. That's not going to happen. Uh, she did not submit a resume. She doesn't have much of a resume. So unfortunately, she is not able to uh, run. We do have, for the Xfinity Series this weekend, the Dash for Cash. The Dash for Cash is going to be run by, of course, four drivers, Dash for Cash. You have Noah Gregson, Josh Berry, who, with his win over there at Martinsville a couple weeks ago, got himself in, as well as Daniel Hemrick, who has been having by far his breakout season in the Xfinity Series. It's only a matter of time till that car snags a win. Um, he looked really good at Martinsville. He's had a couple really good-looking races. Uh, and then you do have Brandon Jones. Uh, Jones, who, of course multiple-time winner in the Xfinity Series. He's a series veteran, so he is going to go on to run um, <clears throat> with a very good finish at Martinsville to go run for that Dash for Cash at Talladega this weekend. In my opinion, Gregson, I'm going to go Gregson to get that Dash for Cash. Uh, obviously, he's got a finish, but he has won at restrictor plate tracks. He is very aggressive obviously. <laughs> very, very competitive, no matter what kind of track we're going to. And he usually does a very good job. Uh, I think he gets it. Um, we do have, uh, with Alex Bowman's win at Richmond, I did end up buying that die cast. Uh, that, I pre-ordered that die cast. I also pre-ordered the Joey Logano Dirt win. So if you guys do get an opportunity to go on there, snag those wins for yourself. Um, I ordered them directly from Lionel. You get free shipping that way. But obviously, you can order from whoever your favorite uh, die-cast supplier is. And last but not least, again, very quick video. Probably going to be just a pinch pass four minutes when I'm done with this. Uh, the NASCAR Foundation. NASCAR Foundation is 15 years old this year. Done a lot of good for the NASCAR community. Uh, a lot of good for people all around the country, around the sport. So congratulations to NASCAR. Definitely a hands up, uh, a round of applause. Before we go, guys, make sure you hit up the Bad Fast podcast. It is available on Spotify as well as a couple other different, uh, excuse me, sunflower seeds, <laughs> as well as a couple other different uh, podcast sources. Uh, this week, I am going to have a different co-host. For those of you guys who do listen to some of these smaller podcasts, that's something I want to go out there and do. If you know somebody that runs a smaller, lesser-known NASCAR podcast, make sure you reach out to me. Give me their handle. I want to go listen to them. I want to give them a shout-out. So make sure you either leave it in the comment section below, or, of course, you can email me, seriouslyfastmedia at gmail.com. Thanks for watching, guys. You have a great rest of your day, and good luck to your drivers this weekend at Talladega.